being on the right side of history. I reckon those of us who are speaking up against this and trying to push back to what is currently going on in the world are going to be the ones who are on the right side of history. Those of us who are for informed consent, for the ability of a person's right to choose what they do and don't get injected into them. It's quite a strange old world right now that we're in, that government and corporations have essentially merged. Maybe it's not so obvious to many, but how is it that this unified response has been actioned around the globe all of a sudden and people are losing their jobs over it? I'm against that. People should be able to remain in their job if they've been in it for years and years and are still fit and able to do their job. Just because they haven't been stabbed with some weird shit doesn't mean they should lose it. It's so insane, especially because the thing that... It's not even doing its job. You can still catch it, you can still go to hospital from it, and you can still die from it. These are all facts. So why is it that people are still losing their jobs? I reckon the people that have stood strong and said, no, nah, I ain't going anywhere, are going to be the ones who are on the right side of history. Those that are speaking up for fundamental human rights. Whether or not you should decide what you get to put in your body. Not someone else, no coercion, no incentives, no bribes. It's a weird, crazy time we're currently in, and I often think it is like some made-up reality world, but it is taking place, and it's quite insane because, I mean, yeah, it's it blows my mind. But I'm going to keep speaking up about this because I feel like it's so important. I feel like things are changing because more people are starting to see inconsistencies with what is going on and like I've been saying has zero to do with health otherwise we wouldn't see all these stupid and inconsistent restrictions being imposed on people even for the ones who have gone and gotten stabbed are still facing these restrictions like surely you'd be asking questions now but let's see we'll have to wait for weeks, months, years to pass to determine whether or not but I'm going to call it now I feel like this is definitely the side that represents fair, free choice where I'm not trying to sell you something whereas the other side is and you might say oh but it's paid, by, paid for by this, that, the other thing I mean the money comes from somewhere the billions don't get made just out of fresh air People are quick to label, and they will do. That's up to them. They can say this, that, and the other thing. Whatever the main fair media want to say, that's up to them. Doesn't change the fact that we are fighting for fundamental human rights, which are sacred and should be held sacred forever through every generation. The right to speak freely about stuff, the right to protest, the right to choose what you do and don't get, in terms of sick care, medical procedure, whatever.